guys. Hello, hello. Ah. You're on my phone. This isn't for the cup we're doing right now. This is for a cup later. Hold on. I can't see any comments. Someone comment really quick. I got to take down my, my jack-o'-lantern. Hi, Tracy. How are y'all doing? All right. This is for later. Um, we have some drips that we're doing. So I have some white mica powder in here. And then I also have a green one. So I'm going to mix a separate one. This one's for my white ones. Yeah, you guys are on my phone, so I probably look a little funny. Thank you for hashtag sparkling. So you guys will be seeing me basically Tuesday through Sunday now. I'm going to still be taking Monday off. Um, but I am opening up Tuesday as well for booking those tumblers. Um, I know it's going to look di gigantic. It really is. Marlena, it depends on the application that I'm doing. So with alcohol ink, I like to use a semi-gloss or a gloss or something along those lines. With glitter, I like to use a matte um, or a flat paint. With mica powder, I also like to use a flat paint. Um, so it just depends on what application I'm doing, really. Miranda! Yes. <laughs> Reschedule them for me. We are back on our normal live schedule. My mother is still here. Um, yeah, my mom's still here. I have, a, I have to bring her to a doctor's appointment tomorrow. Um, and uh, her best friend, Robin, is also in town. So she's here as well. Yes. My goodness, okay, okay, okay. So tonight we have, let me get that other drip started. So I put this in a cup because I'm saving it for a little bit. Um, I'm gonna put this drip and then I need a silicone cup. Is this one clean out? Hi, Brianna. Hi. All right, so we have a three drip cups that we're doing. Uh, two of them are the red with the white drip and um, one of them is green with a red drip. Uh, I kept seeing green in my head so I was, I was going to mix green mica powder in there. It was going to happen. Hi Madeline! I didn't see the one asking for the cups. I didn't see that question, and I can't scroll up because you guys are on my phone, and it's a pain in the booty. Okay, so we're going to get this one mixing. Honey, can you hand me some uh, large sticks? Where do I order my glitter? You guys can find a list of things that I use and recommend on my pinned post at the top of my Facebook page. So if you go to my Facebook page, there's an, a link for some iConnect glitter, and it's by far one of my favorite brands. Um, and I wish I had every single color, honestly. Um, so I would definitely check that out. Oh, awesome. Yes. Sorry. I know I'm a little, I'm not talking right now because I'm, uh, I'm mixing a lot of different concoctions. <laughs> She did. She was married. She's not married anymore. <laughs> not anymore. <sighs> Hi, Lauren. Hi, Laurel. Oh, 
I love this adapter. Laurel, I know your dog cup is done. Your dog cup is done. Travis is doing 3D printed shipping. I didn't do shipping today, but it is on my ship table. So I'm gonna set this out of the way. Sorry, the camera's like right there, and so it's really weird. All right, and now one last mixture, because this has to sit. So while I'm doing the two on the spinner, I'm gonna let these mica powders sit. The cups are already glittered behind me. Um, yeah, and this one's gonna have jingle bells on it. I'm not making a witch's brew. No, we are on to Christmas now, Daniel. This one is going to be a uh, green, it's a green glitter cup with the red drip and the bells on the end and the bells do ring um and then i have two red and white coffee cups as well so this needs green mica powder in it try not to drop you guys no this needs red mica powder red 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 do not put green it is red 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 red, red. Red, 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 red. You see, I almost did it again. We are doing red. I keep them in the epoxy containers. Yeah. Um, I have one for each side, so I don't really feel the need to change them out. Um, every once in a while, I will just switch them out for new ones. So. Sorry, Travis is over there assembling. What are you assembling, babe? Uh, Mexican. Can y'all hear me? I mean, you're banging a hammer. <laughs> mallet. A mallet. Yeah, Travis is over there assembling some uh, epoxy mixers. So, he's smoking a turkey. Because turkeys are only 60-something cents a pound right now. So, my mom picked up a turkey. So, we're smoking a turkey for dinner. So, it should be done probably like... I want to say maybe an hour after my live's over. It should be done. That's a good color. Okay. You thought my wrist was breathing. I know I need a mirror image. No, I just need to figure out my computer. <laughs> Are you know, because I downloaded, uh, because we're doing Patreon now, and I'm sharing my screen, and I'm doing all of those, like, really in-depth tutorials, I needed a bigger program on my computer. Um, and so it's super hard to stream. So I need to build my, my husband's going to build me a computer, basically. <laughs> I need a desktop, um, because my laptop just isn't cutting it for the work that I'm doing. So I'm not backwards, just the local sign. Okay. So we're just on my phone until we figure that out. But I, Travis needs to 3D print me a stand because this is not working. There we go. Ah! Sorry, I am gonna throw my phone like out the door. Stay. Yeah, no, my phone is, or my, my computer has like, three or four major programs on it and it's like a little yoga uh, yoga computer that's meant for like word <laughs> it's not meant for running photoshop adobe premiere uh obs having youtube streaming at the same time as patreon streaming um yeah it's like a lot on my computer Watch Black Friday for a computer. Travis is going to build me a desktop. So I'm going to have like two video cards in it. It's going to have like 10 terabytes of memory. <laughs> like a super fast processor. So he's just going to build me a desktop. Because um, I mean I can buy like a three or four thousand dollar Alienware desktop. Or my husband can just build me an alien, like exactly what's in an Alienware desktop, except with like better video cards. And 
and a capture card and stuff like that for like a quarter of the price. So he's just gonna build me a computer. <laughs> yeah, so I have a ton in store for the Patreon. Um, it's basically you guys, so you guys see my life. So I know there was a lot of questions with Patreon and you guys are like, oh no, are you not gonna be going live on Facebook? Yes, I am because my customers buy tumblers and I show them their tumblers, right? That is the entire thing about having these Facebook Lives is so my, my customers, my clients, can see their tumblers being made. You know what I mean? And of course I like to talk to you guys. <laughs> but um, Patreon's more for learning. So I'm gonna go in depth on like hydro dipping and how not to get the folds what to do with the bubbles and and that kind of stuff i'm gonna go on like wood grains and inks and what not to mix um a lot of silhouette studio because honestly i'm on the silhouette studio a lot so i'm just gonna share my screen every time i'm working you know what i mean um and just be on that and then on the Patreon, there's also, so this new tier, and it's basically a cracker, so I'm sending you a subscription box. Um, sorry, I went wonky. Uh, Christina, it just depends. Um, I haven't shipped anything this week. I have had family in town. I scheduled off. I know, of course, I own a business, so it's really hard to take time off. Um. I wonder if I put this right here. Can you just stay up and just be good? Ah! I'm sorry guys, this is just driving me crazy. We're just gonna have to do it like that. There we go. Um, sorry. Uh, yeah, so like I started this new tier and it's, I know I'm backwards. You're on my phone because I need to figure out why my computer, my computer has too many programs on it. So it's really hard to do lives on it right now. It's driving me crazy. So Travis is, don't worry. We'll, we'll get it figured out. We're going to be on my phone for right now. Um, just because it keeps messing up the lives and it's just frustrating. Um, so the subscription box is basically going to have like the seasonal crafts. Like this month's subscription box is going to have... Um, it's basically like a... I'll be home, home for the holidays kind of thing. We're going to be doing uh, string art. It's where you put little nails into the wood and you string your string. Um, so basically you get your box in the mail and then, um, it'll be on the same day of every month that I do a tutorial. So you'll be able to follow the tutorial and make it and it'll go like seasonal and it might be tumblers too. I might ship cups and everything. I'm going to do a poll and ask who has a turner because I don't want to do a tumbler tutorial one month and someone not have a turner. You know what I mean? So we will figure all that out. And then uh, I know for December we are going to be doing uh, like Christmas ornaments and like a how-to on Christmas ornaments because you guys can sell those at craft shows. I don't sell Christmas in, in ornaments during the holidays. Just, it's just not something I've done. But I've heard people who regularly do craft shows, they sell Christmas ornaments and it's just... So I'm going to teach you all how to make those. There is a link for my Patreon. It's in the description of this video. So, the, and there are three tiers. There's a $1 tier, which is you show on your work, um, loving me. Uh, you get access to a Patreon only feed and stuff like that. And then the $10 tier, you get like behind the scenes, you get all of my tutorial videos, you get basically all access to my Patreon. And then the $45 one is that monthly sub, monthly sub box where it's going to have your treats in it and like a new, uh, almost like a new craft that you guys could possibly put on Etsy. You know what I mean? 
cups are hard. Yeah, tumblers are a little difficult. <laughs> but I mean, you'll get the hang of it. If you really like, if you're watching this and you're like, oh my gosh, I really want to play with this awesome epoxy, then play with it. Once or twice, figure it out. You'll like it, you know? It's hard not to like. The only hard part is like, if you put too much deadlines on you, that's a little hard. But making the actual Tumblr, there's so many resources out there. You have me, you have my, on my Patreon, you can message me on my Patreon and you, you get replied to. I don't have an admin on Patreon, it's strictly me. Um, and then you also have the KEC Creative Crew, which is, I think our group has like five or six hundred women in it. You can ask on there. Shannon, I still have to make lumpia, so <laughs> we did roll the first batch of lumpia, it, but we are all like hanging out and stuff like that. Um, but I still do. You're right. You're right. I have to show y'all how to make lumpia. Who's that for? Who's that? Um, this is for Patricia Runkle, and then we're gonna be doing our three drips back there too, which is nerve-wrackingly fun. <laughs> if that makes any sense. My mother is here, by the way. She is going to be here for another, uh, the week. So she doesn't leave until Sunday. Saturday. Saturday. So I'll do, I'll be doing a live with you. Lumpia. Oh, you know what Lumpia is. You make it often. We did cook the hog. We cooked the entire hog. There's lots of selfies, uh, on, that I've, on my personal Facebook <laughs> of everyone with the hog head and it's apple in its mouth and chickens got loose. Uh, it was a really fun party. It was, it was a really, really fun party. We had a lot of people show up. I had my, a friend, I invited my friend Lupe, not even knowing if she would come because I haven't seen Lupe in, awesome in years. Up. I haven't seen her since, like I've known her, she was at my son's first birthday party. Like I haven't seen her in forever. Um, and she came pulling up my driveway and I was like, oh, oh, little bay. like, oh my gosh, I wanted to cry. Yes, this is the 30 ounce. Uh, Daniela, it would just say small starter bundle. Um, I want to say that we don't, we should have a picture on there. I would, sorry. It's a turner and a small mixer. That's the starter bundle. The starter bundle does not come with the deluxe epoxy mixer. Eden, did you order a sunflower? Did you schedule? Make sure that, because guys, I only have a schedule for today and tomorrow, and I have way more orders than that. So if you guys have ordered a tumbler, please make sure that you schedule your live so you know and I know when we're doing your tumbler. Um, if not, then I can do your Tumblr and you're not even on live and then you'll send me a message and you know, so make sure you guys schedule your Tumblr. It's basically there just to say, Hey, reminder, Katie's going to be doing your Tumblr tonight. Yes, Michelle. Um, so we do, I'm going to be doing like a weekly poll basically. And it's going to, I'm going to ask you guys, what do you want to see? Do you want... Uh, geode, wood grain, or hydrogen. And then everyone will vote, and I'll do that on the weekly tutorial. If that makes sense, it should make Oh, Miranda! Okay. Okay. <laughs> yes, so Eden, you are on tomorrow night. <laughs> There's my mom. It's an ugly sweater. You said that ugly. ugly. No, we're gonna put Christmas ugly sweaters on it, like water slide. <laughs> that is My that is ugly sweater had two reindeer. <laughs> All right. Ah, uh, Danielle, you just order there's a promo code right now. Um there's actually a promo code until the ninth. So you guys gotta hurry up yeah, and order because it's only the fifth. Yeah. It's the fifth. So you have like four days. Um but if you yeah, order a turner and a deluxe epoxy mixer and then if you add like the sticks on and the silicone cup, you'll be able to get uh, that gift 150. <coughs> so it's $15 off. 
Um, yeah. Check it out because it goes by how much you spend. So say you order under $100, you save, I think it's $10. Uh, over 150 you order or you say 15 and then over 200 you save like 25 or 30 30 and then 250 is 35 or 45 one of those and then if you order over 300 you get a flat 25% off which is a lot yes Amy send me a message person you can send me a message if you have any questions about the patreon and how it's gonna work and stuff like that um, but it's all lined up on there. Um, when you click on my Patreon, it's all lined up so you guys can read basically what benefits there are um, on the $10 and the $1 one. Now, I am also new to Patreon. So, I've never had a Patreon before and I've never, like, done any kind of, like, of that I've done tutorial videos, but I've never had like a Patreon. So I'm still learning it too. So there are new features on it that I need to figure out as well that I can add, but I haven't added any of those features because I don't want to add it unless I know what it is. <laughs> you know what I mean? You don't want to just go adding a bunch of stuff and then I'm like, oh, never mind, back it up. Katie has no idea. So I'm still learning it, but what's on there is what's being offered right now. So it can grow. Is that a charge per month to be a part of it? Yes. It's a subscription. Basically, Patreon is made to help support creators, artists, uh, whether it's like a music artist or something like that. If you go to my Patreon, it says click here. And it'll explain exactly what Patreon's for. Um, and why I started one, you know? Uh, so you guys can click on, if you go to my Patreon and you click on that, it's in the description and it says to learn a little bit about Patreon, click here and here is a link. So click there and it'll tell you all about it. Yes, I am still going to be doing my lives now. Yes, these lives are for customers who order tumblers. So Patricia Runkel placed an order. These are all Christmas tumblers. She ordered perfectly in time. Well, her orders are due on the 2nd of December. So she ordered hers a little early, which was awesome because I'm almost done with all of her tumblers. Um, so Patricia ordered tumblers from me knowing that they're going to be on live. So of course I'm not gonna stop doing my lives. You know what I mean? Cause these are for my, my tumblers and I'm still doing tumblers. It's just adding on to the, because over the past few years, you know, we've been growing and I've been teaching a lot and um, this is just going to set time aside so I can teach and I can afford to teach, you know, so I can set time aside and dedicate time to you guys and give you better quality content versus like, oh, let me catch her on live really quick and ask her why my epoxy is giving me fish eyes, you know. There's no more of that. You just send me a message on Patreon and you're like, hey, why is my epoxy messing up? And I'll run through a few questions with you and hopefully I can help you. Hopefully. Okay, I'm gonna make all, make sure all of these little spots are covered in. Looks awesome. So Susan, with my sponsors, I do, uh, I basically have affiliate, like, uh, Amazon and Zyotec are my affiliates. Um, I haven't like ventured out into getting sponsors yet. I want to, but just not right right now, you know. The theme of this cup is, uh, have you guys seen the cup that says uh, never grow up? And it's Peter Pan and uh, all the characters flying in like the infinity sign. That's going to be going on this cup, so it's going to go all the way across. Cup three. It's a Peter Pan cup. I want one. <laughs> huh? Yeah. Well, they're not cold. Oh, well, they're not cold. <laughs> Hi, Lori. How are you doing? Okay. 
I want to put a little bit of night sky glitter on this cup, but I feel like there's a spot or two that I need to uh, touch up. Yeah, so the link to my Patreon is on there. And then if you guys needed to order any uh, materials like epoxy mixers and turners, we do have a giant sale going on right now. So basically, if you're planning on buying multiples of my turners or, any, or cups or anything like that, you can save up, uh, up to 25% on my website until the 9th. So that's only four days away. It's actually the same day my mom is leaving. <laughs> I didn't coordinate that very well, but you know. So it's the same day my mom's leaving. That's the last day of the sale. Uh, so make sure that you guys do, be, don't order anything off the website unless you have one of those promo codes, okay? Because I don't want you guys to miss out on the savings, especially for all of this, all of the holiday stuff going on and Every penny counts, right? Okay. So I am going... Oh, and Travis will probably be adding a little bit... Um, if, if the request is there on the Patreon, you know, a little bit of how to do this, how to do that, and whatever he's helped me with in the past, like running a business. Uh, <laughs> so uh, if the request is there for those Patreons, then um, it will be on there as well. Oh, Eden. Yes, my mom is still here. So I couldn't take the full two weeks off. I took a week off. Um, so I took, I didn't completely take it off. I'd be lying if I said I did. <laughs> but I didn't like, you know what I mean? Um, so I couldn't take the full two, two weeks off because I think that would have been a little too much. Um, I mean, I don't want you guys to forget what my face looks like. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, I do ship to Canada. Yes, ma'am. Um, you can send me a message. If you live in Ontario, it's actually not expensive. <laughs> but I've, all, the others, all the other areas in uh, Canada, is it's, it's not expensive. It's just like, oh, okay. Um, so, send me a message on sort of what you want to order, and I'll measure it out and give you a rough estimate. Um, of course, like all the packing peanuts and all that's not in there, but I can give a rough estimate on how much it's going to cost. I know it's throwing you off, huh? <laughs> I know, I know. It's, a. Uh, we're on my phone. So my computer, basically, I have too many programs on there. Oh, oh. So he'll fix it tomorrow. He's just gonna build me a whole new computer with like a giant brain in it, huh? And I think it's I think it's like a I think I'm gonna get a double video card and a no. capture card and um, a lot of like terabytes of memory. I'm excited. It's exciting. Let's see what's yeah, Carol! I love you, Carol. So yes, my Patreon is up, and if you guys aren't crafters, and you just want to support me, there's always that dollar Patreon where it's a dollar a month. Um, <laughs> and that gets you involved in the community. And that gets you in the crew, basically. You're in the Patreon, you're one of my Patreons. And um, I'm not guaranteeing it, but you know what? I've always wanted to send out Christmas cards, but I just didn't have an address book. Just say. Uh, <laughs> Brian is gone. Yes, Brian left this morning um, at like, we actually went to the truck yard to pick up mom's friend Robin, who's here. Um, so I have my mom and, and her best friend Robin. Um, and my brother left at like six o'clock this morning and I didn't cry. I love my brother. It was really fun having him here. Not even going to lie. All right. So this one is going to be a UT one. Uh, Vicki actually ordered a ton of UT tumblers. Um, and they're all different and it's so fun to do them all. 
Um, so this one's going to be basically ink and some mica powder and some this and some that. Uh, yeah. How did the party go? Did your brother and mom get wild? <laughs> I mean, you could say that. There was a lot of kids here, so, I mean, it was like a family party. Um, but we definitely had a really good time. And I'll tell you what, you can definitely tell when... How many kids were out here? It was over 10. Boogie and both his cousins, too. Don't forget them. He's counting. But you can definitely tell when that many kids have been left. 16 kids. <laughs> so there were 16 kids at my house. Did you include Mary and her, AJ and Dominic? Yeah. yeah. So there were 16 kids at my house, and you could definitely tell the next morning that there was 16 kids at my house. <laughs> you got your 3D pens today? Oh my gosh. I am, I've already gotten a little bit up on the, my uh, Whomping Willow. Um, it's going to take me a while because I just don't have enough time to just sit there and make a giant awesome Whomping Willow tree. Oh, did you guys see my shirt? I went to Walmart and they had all their Halloween on clearance. And this is like a beaded, I don't know, it's really cool. It came with a cape, but my son stole my cape. So I don't have a cape. Yeah. So this one's going to be burnt orange, a little white, um, yeah. Burnt orange, a little white, and then we are going to do our drips back there. Let me check on the drips. Ooh, these are still really liquidy. I will take my time on this one. Yeah, because these are still really liquidy. So we might not be able to do the drips right away. I might have to like pop back on. You know what I mean? I have silicone mold. Oh, like 3D print. I was like, we have silicone molds. <laughs> um, you mean for like the 3D printer? Yes, I want to do silicone molds. For some reason, I'm super nervous about mixing silicone. I did do some research on it, and it cost about the same price as epoxy. Um, so they would be have they would have to be like I don't know, like a sunflower mold, and ones that you can't find online. Like I'm not gonna do a mom and bear mold because you can get that on Amazon. You know what I mean? Um, so it'd have to be like totally different designs. And I was thinking like a spring line, a Christmas line, a Halloween line. Uh, summer line and then just having certain lines sort of how I'm going to be doing my uh my crafting patreon my crafting tutorials with patreon um I want yes crafting's fun okay and we might have a slime tutorial in there somewhere but you can also sell slime on Etsy I'm just saying so most of my tutorials on my patreon are going to be items that you could make and sell not necessarily tumblers because there's a ton of crafts out there so like string art you know um that's gonna be this this month's box so if you sign up to be a patreon we haven't sent it out yet um if you sign up to be a patreon and there's only 30 spots on that because i want to test it out and i don't want to overwhelm myself with a bunch of kits you know what i mean so we're only going to test out with 30. um we're starting off with a max of 30 Patreons on that. So every month you're gonna learn a new craft, you know? Whether it's uh, the string art, and then I'll have stuff for like, we might do, uh, we're gonna do Christmas ornaments um, because you can take Christmas ornaments to craft shows and sell them for like eight bucks a pop, you know? We're gonna do keychain molds. Um, we're gonna do dream catchers because those you can also put on Etsy. So we're gonna do a whole bunch of different things on there and that's sort of how I want to do my molds I want it to go with the seasons so I want I don't 
technically have four seasons in Texas, but my my KEC craft is gonna have four seasons. <laughs> that is not the $10 level. No, the $10 level is tutorials on um, everything. It's gonna be, uh, you're gonna have uh, tumblers, you're gonna have some, the $10 one's gonna have some like uh, small business how-to tutorials. Um, Travis is gonna have some tutorials on there too if you guys are interested in like learning Fusion 360 or anything along those sorts of like 3D printing and that kind of stuff. Um, so you can definitely learn a lot from the $10 one. Um, the crafters one, you're actually going to get a parcel in the mail full of goodies and then I'm gonna have a video teaching you what to do with those goodies and then you can decide oh I love this you know and it's gonna be a different one every month um, I actually had a patreon I was messaging her this afternoon and she mentioned that and some about a subscription box like DIY craft box and I was like oh my gosh that is brilliant because I was going to do like a glitter box, but I'm like, not everyone on my Patreon is going to be doing tumblers, you know? Some people will be making quilts and I don't know. The box is the $45 one. So there's only three levels. One dollar, which is like, you're a Patreon. You're here. You love me. I love you. And we are a family. That's, number, that's the first one dollar. The ten dollar is the insider. You want to know behind the scenes. You want to know... Uh, about this epoxy, you want to know about this glitter, you want to know how to geode, you want to know how to peekaboo, you want to know how to make a drink catcher, you want to know how to mix concrete correctly. Okay, those are all questions for the insider. Um, and all of my Patreons can send me messages um, on Patreon, and I am the only one that replies to Patreon, so you have direct contact to me. It's not like filtered, you're not stacking 120 different messages on my regular inbox. You know what I mean? Um, and then the $45 one is the cracker. The person that wants to get down, create some stuff, okay? That's what it is. If you're in Canada, can you still join? Ooh! Lorraine, let me price out. Send me your, send me a message. Awesome, Amber! I glad did you get the silicone attachment? You'll never run out of a cup. I'm just saying, and it's free shipping. Um, but there is a promo code right now. I'm just letting y'all know before I get started on this. The promo codes are the more you spend, the more you save. Um, they're on my Facebook page. You should click over there, you should check them out. I'm gonna boost them up again later. Um Yes. I need white. I got my white. You're still stuck closed on. I keep forgetting to put the cap on this thing. Might have to mix that with something or another. Alright, and then I do need my black, which I believe my black is on my desk. Yes, it is. Um, I'm gonna grab some regular Valencia orange right there. Perfect. What comes with the starter kit? A small epoxy mixer and a uh, turner. Um, it's not the deluxe epoxy mixer, so it's not the one with the silicone mold. Are you going to do a tutorial on the right way to do epoxy molds? Yes. We will have, again, I will repeat uh, how the tutorial videos are gonna work. So basically, I, I already posted one, and it was like, are y'all interested in like other crafts like dream catchers, design studio, or tumblers? And it was like a half and half race on uh, design studio and tumblers. So I've been doing a lot of ones on design studio, um, and I'm gonna start doing some on tumblers. But basically at the beginning of every week, I'm gonna ask you guys, hey, this week's tutorial, do you want a geode? Do you want a wood grain? Do you want 
uh, the perfect ombre and stuff like that. So you guys, you guys are going to tell me what to teach you on there, you know? So if you're like, I'm really interested in molds and I post and I'm like, Hey, who's interested in molds? And we get some, you know, we're going to do some molds on there. I got plenty of them. Um, and some trials and some tributes and stuff like that. Thank you, Leona. I have a deluxe mixer with a silicone cup fit in that's smaller. Do I need to order the silicone attachment? Uh, yes. Well, the silicone attachment comes with the silicone cup. So this is what you get in the mail. Free shipping. The shipping is included in there because I didn't want to charge $15 for shipping with it. So I just charged the $3 extra for shipping. So, uh, yes, this is what you get in the mail, the attachment and all. It's totally worth it, huh, Leona? Like, because I never have to worry about if I have Dixie cups. <laughs> I just put them in here. And this can actually fit a lot more than a Dixie cup. So if you don't have 20 turners turning behind you, you know, and you can fill this cup halfway up and that will epoxy multiple cups for you. And then you don't even have to worry about the large one either. You just keep it on. What, Daniel? What you talking about, Willis? <laughs> Francis, I saw your name. I know your name. I saw your name. I'm pretty sure you're close to something because I remember your name. I can't remember if it's already shipped or not. I'm not sure. I was keeping up on all of my uh, attachments while my brother was here. Because I print them out in sheets of 12, so they're really easy to package and ship. Okay, so this is some burnt orange that I'm putting on here. This one's actually called Rust. And I have some lighter burnt orange, which is a terracotta. And then I have some uh, Valencia, which is like an orange. I said had moles. I said we're going to do, I have Mold. Mold. <laughs> Did, no. Yep. So the promo code right now, the most you can save is 25% and the lowest you save is 10%. What? It wasn't working for me. I cheated on the uh, on the 3D printer and now he has to clean it. My mom is still here, Leona. Yeah, she's in the house right now. Uh, her friend Robin came in today. Uh, she's also a truck driver. Robin's a truck driver. So she came in today to hang out with my mama. Um, so my mom's going to be here till Saturday. She took two weeks off. <laughs> I couldn't take two weeks off. I would have loved to, but I can't take two weeks off. I can't do that. Not in the middle of November. It ain't happening. Uh, Laurel, I haven't tested it out. I, I, I think it depends on the volume you mix in it. Um, that's a great question, and I need to put that on my to-do list to test out. Um, and so I can time and see how long it takes to stir and all that. So, I, when I test it out, I will make that announcement um, because it's only a little bit bigger than a Dixie cup, you know. So, I don't see why it wouldn't, but I don't want to say for sure yes because I personally haven't tried it out. You know what I mean? I need some more of this dark stuff right here. There we go. You talk funny. Where are you from? <laughs> uh, well, I live in Texas, and I'm from California, so I think I'm just a little confused. <laughs> You're from New Hampshire? Yeah, I don't... I've never actually been up to... I've been to the northern states, but I haven't, like, you know, lived in the northern states. Pennsylvania's... Oh, I did live in Pennsylvania. And I lived in Colorado, so I'm wrong. I lived up I lived up north. Yeah. You lived in every single region. 
I have, huh? So can we move to snow? <laughs> I say that, and then when it's like really cold, I'm like, I just need a blanket and hot cocoa. This ain't this ain't happening right now. <laughs> There we go. So does anyone have any questions about the current promo codes um, or the Patreon or the YouTube or anything like that? I know it's all very new um, and new stuff can sometimes be overwhelming. So if you guys have any questions, you can send me a message um, to the page. And if you have any questions with like needing help with designing or anything like that you can uh message me as a patreon and i will help out with that so let me know if y'all have any questions upstate new york manchester pennsylvania is north it's north i'd say so north. Texas. Yeah, I'm in Texas too. <laughs> yep. I I I dig Texas. I've lived in a lot of states. I like Texas. I wouldn't mind living a little more north so I could have some snow and be further away from the city. Um That's just me. But I truly don't mind living in Texas. It's Texas. Why, why, why are you clogged? What? My thing is clogged. My little, my dripper thing is clogged. Your dripper thing? Yeah, my dripper thing is clogged with, I need like a hair tie or a really small Allen wrench. Do you have a really small Allen wrench? Like, I don't think you have one small enough. No. Wait. Or a needle. Wait. <laughs> it's not working. He's searching. My house like really turning. Like, uh, How do you keep your ink at the rim of the cup when turning? So Mine so slipped down some. Reza, we can do a. Um, I've just done this. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> it stays up there. Um. <laughs> you're like I'm sorry. What's going to be this one's a uh, a UT Longhorn cup. Do you have a needle or not? What are you doing? No? Yeah. I'm checking over. Uh, ah! Got it! Got it! Um, Reza, we'll do some tutorials if you want to join the uh, Patreon. We'll do some tutorials on ink and different techniques of ink and all that kind of stuff. So if you guys and um, so if you guys have any questions, and you can personally message me on there, and I can give you some tips and tricks. What, Jenny? That's cool. Yeah. So this one's going to be uh, UT Longhorns. Uh, Vicky actually has a lot of Longhorn tumblers. Everyone in her, I think, they've been. UT alumni for throughout their entire family. Um, yeah, so a lot of people are getting this for their for Christmas. What about the month of November? I can't see that comment.
Is it bad that we have a half a pig in our fridge and I still want tacos from the taco stand? Yep. It's just been so long since I've had tacos. So it was yesterday. You literally had tacos yesterday. Remember what we ate last night? We had enchiladas yesterday. What's the difference? It's not a taco? No. <laughs> I think you have a problem. Do you like Texas as well as San Diego? Yes. Lori, I like Texas more than San Diego. What? Okay, it's beautiful to visit. Beautiful to visit. Love it. But I don't think I'd ever want to live in California again. It's just, I, w I can visit there every year. Every year, go to the beach, be a tourist of my hometown. Um, but I mean, the people here are great. I don't have to worry about everything I worried about in California. You know what I mean? And that stuff's like not around the corner. And I don't know, I guess there's not as much as a, of a economical gap in Texas. Hey. Everyone's, in California, it's like, dip, dip. you know, there's like no in between. <laughs> so it's definitely, I would, I love to be able to vacation there. If I lived in California, I don't think I'd be able to vacation anywhere else. <laughs> but no, California always has my heart. Um, but I love the Southern lot. I love the Southern people. Uh, yeah. You, you know, going... Um, to the hill country or out to a mom and pop restaurant in Conroe. You know, I can go down to so many different barbecue restaurants that are just owned and operated here in Texas. And, you know, it's just like driving out to Austin, you just see little, I don't know. I just, it feels really homey here. Does my mom live in Texas? No, my mom lives on a truck. She's a truck driver. That's why she's here, and that's why I'm like, oh, family's here, everything in the world, stop. <laughs> All right, after this cup, we're gonna, I'm going to check on these drips, and we are going to see if the drips are ready to be dripped. Okay? Um, if they are, we will start dripping. I don't think we need to add black, but we can add a little black, because I know she wanted to add a little black. So we'll just add a little bits of spots of black just to highlight the white. Done. Hold on, I can't read that comment. Yeah, I mean, it It definitely is wonderful here. I love it. Oh, this is getting pretty thick. Oh, we might be able to do our drips, y'all. I need to put a little bit of mica stripes on here. That'll actually look kind of cool. There we go. Put it right there. Just a little. Let me take this one off and plug her in over yonder. Ah. Okay, and we are going to grab some awesome cups that need to be dripped. Okay, I am going to grab a piece of white paper to put these on. Ooh. A 
Okay, and I'm gonna give these another little spritz with a sealer. No, that's a varnish, okay. Okay. I love you, Carol. No, Betty, I blow. That's my technique is I, I blow my ink around to get my waves in it. Um, if I want like a swirl, I normally use mica powder um, and ink. Uh, if I want like that consistent swirl, yeah, I'll use mica powder and ink. But if I want it to look different like galaxies, I'll mainly blow my ink around. All right, and there will be a, uh, we need to do an in-depth video on this in our Patreon group as well. So I'm going to use, uh, not a lot, because I actually don't want these going too far down, because they are going to have like decals, and it's a smaller canvas. Um, so I'm going to put this around my edge. And these are drip cups. You can be so imaginative with drip cups. They are just awesome. Um, my first drip cup was a witch's brew one, and it was purple with green dripping down, and it said witch's brew in gold. I made two of those this last Halloween. And then the Frankenstein one, that one was awesome. That one was just awesome. He had 3D ears and everything. Okay, hold on. I am going to... I want this handle to have a big drip down it. Because I just love the way it looks. Okay. So I'm setting that one there. Right? Everyone needs a painted wrist to be marked as the crew. <laughs> I really just need to learn how to put on gloves when I'm spray painting my tumblers. <laughs> but I don't. I just go ahead. I grab my tumbler. I start sanding. My spray paint's right there. It's already on my hand. Like... I think it's wonderful for your skin. My hands are really soft. <laughs> All right. Bye, Lori. Love you. Thank you for tuning in. I did not see the advice comment. It went too fast. Up where? Nice up where as they used to be. Where are you? Um, yes, and just to let you guys know, another benefit about that Patreon is you guys get to message me with your questions anytime you want. Um, and I check my, my Patreon's actually on my phone. It's my one app that I actually have notifications for. Um, yeah. I took my notifications for everything off because my phone will just like bing, 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 bing. But my Patreon's one of the only apps that I actually have a notification for. So if you message me on Patreon, um, you get to talk to me and me. <laughs> so I don't think I'll ever have an admin on there. Maybe if I get like really, really, really busy. Um, but I don't think I want to get so busy that I won't be able to give my individual attention. You know what I mean? That's what my Patreon's for individual attention. This is mica powder. Oh, I have lots of gloves. I have lots of gloves. I apply my epoxy with gloves on my back turners. I just don't put them on when I do my paint because I'm completely okay with having paint on my hand. I'm good with it. Okay, I'm going to add a little more and now this is going to get a heat gun to it. 
I have some more epoxy, but I don't quite know where all of these drips are going. So, we are going to do this. When I go to work with paint on my hand, they look at me like crazy. Well, normally I only go to like Walmart and Aldi and Home Depot and they all know me. So, like, oh, what you painting today? Actually, my favorite cashier at HEB, uh, she's a grandma and her grandson goes to my son's school. So, we see each other at like the kindergarten roundups and stuff like that. Um, and how did I let this sit? I mixed it at the beginning of live, and so it's been sitting for, I don't know how long I've been live. It's been sitting for about, I don't know, I want to say an hour. And it goes on really thick, so you have more control on the drips, and that's what you want. My first few batch of these cups, I ended up stripping. Um, because they looked great. And then you give it a little bit, and the drips go so far down, you're like, oh my gosh, it is literally stuck. Yeah. So, you don't want to put it on too thick, because these drips do start taking over. So I painted my tops of them white because you could see, the, at first I just did the whole thing red glitter and I was like, oh, the mica powder will cover it. No. You could see it through it and then I was like, I don't want to put another layer on because that'll look funny, so let's just strip that. And I was like, oh, it's going down too low. Okay, let's strip that one. Yeah, it took me a lot of trial and error to try to get these things right. <laughs> My brother is probably just getting home and he's probably going to sleep. He left at 6 o'clock this morning and he had a 13 hour drive. So, I don't imagine he'd be trolling me tonight. If he is, then he's a dang trooper. Tell you what, this needs a little more over here. So I think for both of these cups, I mixed a total of 20 mil and I put a full, I don't even know how many grams that is. I'll look on the package. I don't know if it was five grams. It might've been a full five grams of white mica powder in here. Okay. Sorry guys. I know I'm not like super talkative right now. Ooh, 
I have a feeling that's going to go down a lot. A lot. Okay. That looks good right there. A little more right here. Turned out really cute. I want to drip right there. Right. Okay, this one is done. I'm gonna leave her hanging. There we go. Oh, sorry. Okay, let's finish up on this one, and then we have one more after this to do with the drip. Blue or purple snowflakes? Yeah. So I'm basically going to put like where I want, because I did that top rim of white. I want to make sure that that top rim of white is, is covered. Sorry. Travis is being a little uh, extra. extra over there. gosh you're looking beautiful don't drip drip over yonder okay 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 Woo. Woo. okay I'm done touching her I'm done touching her she is done go over there huh. so nerve-wracking okay Heat gun! Yeah, it's a heat gun. I'm gonna give this a little spritz because it needs to be sealed. I sealed it, but I can feel some loose glitter. And I know for a fact it's gonna roll up in the stuff. That is super empty. Where's my triple stick? Right here. Oh my gosh. Y'all, it's like right here. <laughs> I love these too. If you guys wanted to order these, they are super fast for me to do, so you can get them in time um, to use in December. You know what I mean? And you guys can use that promo code that we have. The promo code is good for until the 9th, all right? After the 9th, um, there's not gonna be a promo code for Christmas orders, and I would love if I had all of my Christmas orders in by the ninth, <laughs> so I can have time to work on them and not be rushed. 
All right, all right, all right. With this one, I'm changing out this popsicle stick because it broke. All right, I might have to heat this up a little bit. I did mix it at the same time as that white one, so it's a bit, um, it's definitely solid. So this one is going to have some uh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bell rock. And I forget which decals she's putting on it, but I know it's super cute. Oof. Oof. So as you can see, I am putting this one on a lot thicker than that one because I want these ones to actually go down. It's like spreading, uh, you know that wax that you put on your eyebrows? <laughs> it's like spreading that. Uh. Hold on, there's a tough piece on here that I'm going to just pick off. Oof, I need my exact knife, what? What? The double play? What's a double play? What does that mean? <laughs> Daniel! Okay, I think I let this one sit too long because it's really thick on me. Let's see if it even drips right now. I'm not sure. Mm. All right, I'm gonna give this one more go. One more go. Oh, it keeps stopping? And you have to hit play again. I don't know why. That's weird. I don't think that's anything I can do though. I think that's just Facebook. Yeah, I think that's either Facebook or your app that's messing up. Stephanie, yes. You sand it really well. Just make sure before that last layer of epoxy that you put on, you sand very well. But before I upload it to my YouTube, I will replay it and check it out just to make sure it's not messed up. Um, can I use your hand? Just like stick your hand here. No, like, uh-oh. Like I'm gonna need you for a second. So you might wanna get comfortable. This is why I love my husband. Yeah, you have turns for this, right? You are correct, but your hand's here. Okay, rotate. Really? No, like, yeah. yeah. No, that, that was good. That was good. Okay. And I want to make sure I get it all the way up. And you are correct. I do have turners for this. So why am I here? Because I love you. <laughs> almost done. I'm almost done. I know your arm's probably getting tired.
strips because I really don't want to have to strip this cup. The white one strips perfectly. So, but I really don't want to have to strip this cup. So we're just going to, I might have to add more red later. I'm pretty sure I let it sit too long. We'll see. We'll see. It looks like a little bit dripping. Right there. Right there. All right. All right. All right. is too long. <laughs> yeah, baby. Ah, oh, yeah. Show everybody about your new uh, tier. I did tell everyone about my new tier, and a lot of people are interested in it, so hopefully we have a fun crafting session next month. Actually, this month. I haven't sent out for the month of November, so this month is going to be string art, and we might throw in an extra, like, bonus in there because I want to get a... Uh, I want to get a Christmas tutorial in before December, or we might do it December 1st. And we might end up having our tutorials uh, the 1st of December. So, I will probably do the closing or something like that. I don't know how I'm going to word it. Um, yeah. How's my 3D printed tree coming? Um, I need more time to work on it. Someone needs to request a video for 3D printing. <laughs> so you cool? Yeah, isn't it cool? I saved these ones for last because they're uh... I think I'm gonna have to strip this one. It's not doing what I want it to do. See? It's supposed to be like that. So, I left it for an hour and a half. Basically, I'm just going to take that red piece off, touch up my green glitter, and we'll probably have this one on tomorrow night. Um, can I have the alcohol spray? Because I'm covered in a boxy. What's going on this cup? Um, well, let me set this cup over here. <laughs> Um, that cup's gonna have, I think it's an elf face with the word belief. Yeah. This is what it was supposed to look like. This one's sitting up here dripping. Really? That's graceful. Um, this blue one right here is a beautiful ombre. Yeah. Uh, this one doesn't have a home. I think I'll make it for one of, it's the same colors as my mom's company, so I think I'll put like their logo on it and she can give it to one of her as a gift. I don't know, I think I have, I have two or three more blue ones over there. Okay, I am rinsing the epoxy off of my hands because this has been an awesome session. Oh, um, tomorrow night I believe we have, I don't know if it's the same person's orders. It might be the three of the same person's orders. Peggy, if you want the blue, I can slap a decal on it and send it to you. Because it doesn't have a home. Um, I'm still here. I'm looking for a rag. Ha! Found one! Both your kiddos like the red mug. They're really cool. It's going to have, I mean, it's like roasted marshmallows, right? Yeah, the green one didn't work out uh, as much as I like. So limit of two cups to drip. No more than that because you don't have enough time. 
Good evening. Patricia, don't look at the green one. I'm redoing it tomorrow. But the white and red one came out really pretty. Oh. All right, you guys. I am going to hop off. I have to wait till police officers pick up their uniforms. Yes, Peggy. Um, I'm going to hop off. I'm going to go eat some smoked turkey that my husband nicely made for us. And, um, Katie, can you tell me the sky size of the little screw? Oh. <coughs> An M4. It's yours, uh, Jenny. Yours is in the mail. It was picked up two days ago. But if you really, really want it today, then it's an M4. Emily, that would be a question. Uh, it depends on the Sunset Cup. Um, that would be a question for either my Patreon page or the KEC Creative Crew. Um... Yeah, I've done sunsets and all. I've done glitter, mica, and ink. So it just depends. It should, Patricia. Send it to me again. Drips are very, uh, they have ridges. So. I've never had a pro. Most of them, I mean, it goes like, it goes with the flow of it. Yeah. Um, so we're going to hop off. Babe, babe, you want to say hi? Do you have any uh, anything that are you eating the chocolate? Yeah. Daddy tax. Daddy tax. <laughs> Reese's. <laughs> so yes, guys, make sure you like and subscribe to my YouTube. It is new. It has about three to four videos on it. This video is gonna be on it. Um if you guys are interested in learning more in depth about Patreon and how to do things and why is this happening and having someone there to always help you out, um, that's Patreon. And if you want to learn a bunch of new crafts, including uh, string art and reef making and just all sorts of fun stuff, um, join that crafters one. All right. Uh, and I will check you guys out tomorrow. Right.